This is a Straw Rockets competition with about 150 students from the Cleveland Metropolitan School District. Uh, they're fifth grade students and they've been working on this in their classroom for about two weeks, give or take. And today is the culminating event. So they're really just coming here to show their stuff and show what they've learned over the last couple weeks. So it's a kind of a four stage process where they start by really just exploring one variable at a time. They explore the diameter of the straw, meaning just obviously the size of it, the length, they add some nose weight with some clay, and then they add what we call fins. There are two competitions today, one which is distance, so they want to create a rocket that goes as far as possible, obviously, and then the other is accuracy, so they want, to, they want it to land up in a about a half meter diameter circle. It's been a great event. Um, I think we've been doing it for about 10 years. Mm -hmm. And so the Arconic Foundation uh, supports the STEM and uh, uh, we try to support with uh, quite a few volunteers. So between the volunteers in the classroom and the uh, Arconic Foundation, we just think it's a great event for uh, these kids to be able to you know, meet some engineers and uh, learn about some of the things that we do. And, and uh, so we continue to find it to be a great event for us to support. It's a great STEM project. It really is uh, very helpful to number one engagement, right? It's, it's kind of fun. It ends up with a competition, but we are, it allows us to go through the scientific method, you know, where we're checking one variable at a time. How does that impact accuracy, the distance? Um, so I think it does a great job of teaching them, yet at the same time, they're having a great time.